Two days before the NATO summit in Chicago, demonstrations have already begun. Activists gathered at Daily Plaza in the center of Chicago to make their opposition to the alliance heard. Uh, I'm protesting anything that's to do with a military industrial complex. Obviously, NATO would be a huge one right there. NATO is a war machine. That's what's wrong with NATO. They want more war, more war. We don't want any more war. I, I believe that NATO is global terror. Um, they become the world police, and and when acting as the world police, they're murdering people in other countries. The rally in the city center drew not only anti-NATO demonstrators, but also a myriad of other protest groups, like hundreds of nurses and the Occupy movement. This protest was more about economic issues that have little to do with the NATO summit this weekend. It's not just about NATO. I mean, we're, we're here in solidarity with everything that Occupy has to do with. We're here protesting Monsanto. We're here to protesting NATO. We're here to protest endless wars. We're here to, we want to tax corporate America, make them at least pay 1% because they don't pay much. I'm here with Students for a Democratic Society, and we are protesting NATO's involvement in every global conflict. Um, we're here to support the, the nurses' union today and strongly support the Robin Hood tax. The demonstrators protested peacefully under the watchful eye of the Chicago police and say that this is also their plan for Sunday when the two-day NATO summit begins. Yes, uh, we will be having a meditative protest. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll be led by a reverend who is from Occupy Oakland and, and we will be demonstrating peacefully in a very Gandhian style. The police have been preparing for the event for nearly a year to ensure the security of the summit. And whilst a handful of arrests have been made at earlier protests leading up to the NATO weekend, the overall mood at this demonstration was mostly festive. Anne Carsteveniers, reporting for the NATO Channel from Chicago.